Hi, this is Melanie from Connect Pro. Today I'm going to show you how to install RAM into your computer. RAM is otherwise known as random access memory, but most people just call it memory for their computer. Now before we begin, you'll need to determine the type of RAM that will work with your computer. You can find this out by reading your operator's manual. So let's get started. The first thing you'll have to do is completely shut down and unplug your PC. If you're at home, the best place to replace the RAM will be on a flat, non-static surface, such as a kitchen table or a desk. Gently lay your computer on its side for easy access. Touching the inside of the case should be sufficient to eliminate any static electricity. Remove the side access panel and gently move any wires or parts out of your way, remembering where they came from. Next, determine the correct location or slot to add your RAM. If you don't know where to look, consult your user's manual. Typically, the slots are all straight and may have other RAM currently in place that will look similar to the RAM you're about to add. Open the clips on either end of the RAM slot. Make sure you're properly aligned and then push the chip straight down until the clips automatically snap into place. Now replace or reinstall any parts that you may have had to remove earlier and put the side panel back in place. With everything in place, it's time to ensure your PC is working properly. So plug it in and power it up. I suggest picking up a diagnostic disk, such as Windows Memory Diagnostic, to test the RAM you just installed. This test could take up to a full hour, but it'll ensure that the RAM you installed is compatible and not defective. Once the tests are completed, remove the disk and reboot your PC. Now log into Windows and click on the Start menu. From there, right click on Computer, then click Properties. The Properties window will pop up and display the total amount of RAM installed on your system. Congratulations, your PC should work a lot faster, especially if you were running Vista on less than two gigs of RAM. Well, that's it for now. If you have any questions or you need some help installing your RAM, visit FutureShop and speak to a Connect Pro expert.